Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Diecast Alfie. Uh, welcome to all my new subscribers. Thank you very much for giving me the chance to show you some of my videos uh, and I hope you enjoy them. And uh, obviously, um, hello to all my regular subscribers. Although, I'm still concerned about my man Zelda, my number one fan. I've still not heard from him. So, if you're out there, Zelda, hey, if you've had enough of watching me videos, mate, that's fine. Just let me know you're okay, that's all. All right, mate. Uh, Zelda, uh, he knows who he is. Now, um, I'm still at the back end suffering from this virus, cold, whatever it is. I just cannot shake it off. Um, I, I, I This morning... It's Tuesday 26th, is it? Let's have a look. Tuesday 26th of March. And I can assure you, I uh, this morning I thought there's no chance am I going to do any videos again. I was just me. I was having a coughing fit. I, I've not, I think I told you last time, I've not slept in my bed. I'm sat on the edge of the bed just going to sleep because the minute I lie down, I just cough my guts up. And... Um, so I do apologise if during this video I have a little bit of a cough, um, but hey ho, there's nothing I can do about it. Um, I'm 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 fighting. A, <laughs> I really am fighting it. It's awful. Um, it's not been a, a very good one at all. Luckily, it's loose on my chest, but it's just a tickly chest. <coughs> <coughs> now then. You can see in front of me, I've had to make the decision, and it's been a hard decision. Um, I, when I first started collecting, when when I, when Mini GT brought out right right hand drive, left hand drive, I, d I decided from that moment onwards I was going to buy a left hand drive and a right hand drive. And as time progressed, the room uh, just got you know, smaller and smaller for me to display them to the point where I ended up <coughs> um, putting my left-hand drives all in a, in one of my cartons, in one of my boxes. So I've got, I don't know, two, three hundred maybe in a, in a box. Now, there's not any of the particularly earlier ones that are, you know, hard or there's, there's nothing spectacular. But when all said and done, some of them... Um, if you're a left-hand drive country, you know, you might not have or they're hard to get. Now, those of you who know that I do a bit on eBay, I, I, and, and you probably think, oh, oh, yeah, he does him, but his prices are not very good. because, Well, I've told you all about the prices, but straight away what I do, sometimes I just haven't got a clue. So I just chance my arm, throw a price up, and you know what? If it sells, it sells. I'm not out to rip anybody off. Um, so, what I've done today, um, you know, if anybody's actually after a particular left-hand drive one, most of them are opened. Now, when I say opened, in the early days, do you remember, we didn't, I didn't know that there wasn't any chases. So, the only reason they've been opened is to see if there was a chase in them. No chase, straight back in. So they've not even been out of the plastic containers. So there's the perfectly brand new models. And I've just put... There's a few that I've stuck on eBay. And they're right in front of you now. Number 5. The, the, the Nissan 149 Lamborghini Huracan. The JPS 179. I know this one's tasty. The Porsche 911 GT2 RS Wazak Wazak or Wazak package number 63. Number 93, the Pandem Nissan. All left hand drive, by the way. And the Pandem 124 Nissan and the Liberty Works Lamborghini Huracan 148. Now, the reason I've put them here is because anyone who knows anything about eBay knows that 
I can't start negotiating with you. So when people start talking, can you do this? Can you? No, I can't. Because one, they monitor your messages. They stop me sending messages because they're monitoring it. It's like a, an AI robot will look at you. And I can't do you any special prices on there because they take they take liberties. <laughs> yeah, they definitely take liberties. But they take the fees out. They've got this, blah, blah, blah. They've got this, that, and the other. So, unfortunately, um, I can't do the deals on the eBay. If you come to me outside of eBay, where my internet, uh, uh, well, my Facebook is Alistair, A-L-I-S-T-A-I-R, Lomas, L-O-M-A-S, Alistair Lomas, find me on Facebook and messenger me. You're not going to get them half price and you're not going to get them for the price I paid. So don't think you, you can because you can't. Because that was the whole idea a, a lot of the time of me buying two and this, that and the other. Was was to try and make a few pounds just to fund my own collection. So I've told you and told you and told you. I'm not going to sit on them for two years. Lay out money and then sell them for the same price. Because it will all have been a waste of time. However, I can do you much better prices than eBay, you, you know, and, and the, the thing is, I can talk to you, and we can, you know, come to some kind of an agreement, um, Some sometimes, not all the time, uh, or you can email me on alfie, A-L-F-I-E, 3932, at gmail.com, two ways, Facebook, Alistair Lomas, or alfie3932, now, I will send them abroad um, at your your expense for, for, for payment, uh, what is it, postage. But at the end of the day, all payments are direct into my bank account, which, when all said and done, it, there's nothing wrong with that. People have a bit of a fear of paying into a bank account. I don't know why, because it's, um, what do you call it? It's um, a traceable thing. My bank is the National Westminster and it's just, I give you a bank account number and I give you a sort code. And you're, you're perfectly traceable from your bank into my account. And as I say, we can come to you know, a decent deal, hopefully. Um, but I'm not going to give all my profit away just because I'm off eBay. And if you don't like it, pay on eBay. Um, or if you don't want it, <laughs> get it elsewhere that's cheaper, Alibaba and all the rest of it. It's, it's perfectly your choice. I'm not forcing anybody to do anything. I'm just giving you the opportunity um, to ask. I, I mean, I've got many, many spares. Um, as I say, unfortunately, I'd, I'd like to to give them you cheaper, but I, 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 I'm not going to fiddle myself. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm certainly not going to fiddle with myself, but I'm not going to fiddle myself. That's an English joke, by the way. Now then... Um, now, also, I've been considering, and I, no, I won't, no, I'll, I'll leave that one alone, um, because I've got 47, uh, sorry, 40 odd chases, and I'm kind of, some of, most of, mm, a lot of them I like, a lot of them I'm not that bothered about, they're all sat in a drawer. Now, again, anyone who's after a job lot, well, make me an offer. Uh, but you know what the prices are on average, you know, for for them. I, I think that's going to be my last resort because, you know, um, I do love my chases and I'm I'm hoping one day to get the room so I can display them. You know, I, I don't I don't get the chases to sell. I get the chases, you know, to keep because I I love the chases. This is all the Kaido ones, by the way, not the ones for the normal cars. Right, well, we're nine minutes into this video. I've done nothing but waffle. And um, I don't know how, me, how you thought my light came out on the... Look at me in my hands here. I think I'm a magician. <laughs> um, I got a new light dinner for my last two videos and I thought it looked a bit blue. Now, it, I know it's about colour temperature and all that, but I, I ain't that clever. So, the thing is with this light, although it's got different settings... It doesn't tell you what setting is what colour temperature. So I know your camera does, but this doesn't. Anyway, so I've just adjusted it slightly from last time. I've tried to make it a little bit warmer. Um, 
So, without further ado, obviously I'm not going to do the reviews of these left-hand drive things. I just wanted you to have a look at them, that's all. Just in case. I say you'll have to excuse my voice, it's a bit wobbly. Um, oh, it's been shocking. I, I've only got to, uh, energy now because I've just taken... I've taken two 30 milligram 500 cocodamol, which blow your brain off. Uh, I'm, I'm dosed up on them at the moment, but I've got to do because the pain's unreal. That's going through. It's like a poison running through your veins, right? But there's people worse off than me. So today we're going to look at this one. Now I, I thought they forgot about us in England. It's number 92, and it's the Kaido Datsun. 510 wagon 4x4 now obviously it's a Christmas edition isn't it um, I presume it was a Christmas edition it's all Christmassy anyway <laughs> um, usual stuff on the back bottom right hand corner is the UPC barcode bottom left Nissan Corporation official licensed product and the TSM authenticity there. Okay, so we're going to have a look at that rascal. I've already opened these, obviously. So, it says from uh, Datsun, Ting Tong, Tider House. Don't know what the Ting Tong says. Um, beyond the realms of my. Capability, Kaido House, Nissan, Nissan Mini GT. Okay, so let's let's get her out. Stick her there. Now, I'm not going to get these out because there's your two your two surfboards. I only make a mess of it. I'll probably break them, the clips and what have you. Right, so then. It's quite a nice colour, this. I liked it. I liked it when I saw it uh, advertised. Nice white roll cage. Big white fat Nissan wheel, wheels. But it's got a lovely paint job. It's like a speckly. When we get it close up, you'll see what I mean. It's got like a speckly blue paint job very very nice we'll get that engine bay up as well nice steering wheel in there we'll get a close up nice a roof rack that that's written across the top of the visor spoiler at the back some nice tampos on the side two nice yeah, rubber wing mirrors and really nice. Okay, let's get her on there for a start. Let's get her close up. Okay, yeah, very, very nice. Very nice, nice machine, nice. things falling around me see them wheel arches are very high aren't they <laughs> looks a bit mm, strange I presume they're the same as the other ones not sure if you can see that blue sparkly there or just for my benefit don't panic but I'm going to change the lighting. Is that any better? No, it's worse. Just to say, I was just what I was curious, really. Yeah, nice front end. The kind of painted headlamps that I, I don't know what they are. They're not. They're not inserted as such. I think it's just part of the grill itself inside and what have you nice front skirt with the ting tang written on the front don't know what to say what that's what that means it's 
So it's all nice tampos across the side. So nice little wing mirrors. Something written on the front. Bonnet. Don't know what. See on the bottom right of the bonnet. Well, uh, dear. Same, same on that left hand side. Well, my left, it's the right hand side in it, I suppose. Left as you look at it from the front. Okay. Say so the nice surfboard bars on the top. Say that paints like a nice speckly paint. Nice rear end. As the vicar said to the bishop, bum bum. <laughs> now it's got blue painted indicators. I'm not sure what that, that's all about. Unless he's trying to be uh, dibble. Nice painted um, number plate, I, I say. I do like that. Got that ting tong again across the back. Not sure what that, that is. Nice detailed bottom end with these these kaidos. It, it, it's the quality that you would expect of a kaido house. Uh, very very nice these. I, again, I wasn't sure of them when they first brought them out. You know this uh, casting, but I've been very impressed with them. A white exhaust. Uh, yeah, I've been very impressed with them to be honest with you. Been really, really nice. Yeah. Not sure why they went to all the trouble of putting the blue indicators on. And uh a boring headlamps on the front. I don't know if you can pick that up. Right, now before I forget, let's try and get this... Uh, let's try and get this uh, bonnet up. And there we go. Come on, baby. There we go. Can't really see that much in... Yeah, it's quite a nice, nice engine bay. See it better there, can't you? Nice engine bay. Nice. I mean, I can put the thing. Do you want me to put the uh, the surfboards on? Go on, I'll, I'll treat you. <laughs> if I break them, well, well I can only. Oh, I can't. I'm hopeless. They just pop out of the the base thing. Let's try and see how easy it is to put, put them on. I'm hopeless, mate. You know, when it once it comes to the nitty gritty of sticking stuff on oh come on 57 you know oh come on ah, there you go I need an assistant preferably female <laughs> oh there we go Very nice. Just put them there before I do any damage. And there we go. Dear, <coughs> 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 oh dear me. Yeah, very nice. Now then. I wasn't sure if I was good, that's why I never mentioned it. 
whether we're going to have the time but we've got the time so I'm going to show you the chase I'm going to show you the chase of this rascal and there she is got to make sure I don't drop it very nice um, I like the way that they've gone back to basics and you know the uh, the brushed metal look not just the dodgy colour difference of a wheel you know because uh, they were annoying me with that so they, they, well done Kaido you've listened and uh, and you've gone back to basics and uh, very very nice but to be honest with you I, I, I like the I like the blue you know it's super, I mean that that's a lovely car don't get me wrong a model it's a lovely model but it's um, no nicer it's nice in its own right but it's no nicer in my opinion than the uh, the normal version Okay, I'm not going to go on about it for ages this one because uh, we'll get a comparison and you remember we've got the 27 minute limitation which I used to get caught out on quite often because I'm useless at my timings but now I have the timer clock on and uh, and I can see what, what, what we've got left. So we've still got the white roll cage the blue indicators the white exhaust so to me it just looks like unless i'm uh, getting it wrong here it's just the fact that it's a brushed metal but chrome finish yeah uh, and that's uh the, the, yeah that's got red in Yes, they both got red interiors. Okay, so let's put them both together. Ooh. Oh dear. Very nice. Yeah, very nice indeed. Put that there. So, uh, what, I told you, look, they've got minds of their own. I've just got to watch they don't fall off the back, because if they fall off the back, they, uh, they'll have to go to in, into car hospital, and we don't want that, because little things fall off. Just like old men, little things fall off. <laughs> 57, you know. Oh, let's get that over there. It was bugging me. There we go. Yeah, very, very nice. What I should do, really, but I'm that kind of guy. I'm a risky, risk taker. I'm not going to put the um, surfboards on that one. So, but anyway, I've showed it to you. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed the video. As I said, I'm going to try and do a couple now because my tablets have kicked in and <coughs> my coughing is <coughs> not too bad at all. Oh, compared with what it was, what it has been for two and a half weeks, it's been shocking. So, okay, well, I'd like to thank everyone again. Uh, hit the like button if you've enjoyed the video. And uh, hit the uh, the bell and the notification if you want to subscribe to me. And uh, enjoy your hobby. Anyone who's interested in saying any left-hand drives, not the very early ones, as I say. Um, maybe we're starting in the 300s. Maybe I've got left-hand drives, most of them ordinary ones, and I've got these that I've currently got on eBay. So if you want to look at them, look at them. Uh, what am I? Um, 
what am I on eBay? I don't even know what I am. I better have a look for your honor. Oh, I'll tell you, I'm going to show you as well. Uh, what am I on eBay? I don't, I don't even know. 57, I'm hopeless. Oh, come on, why is that? Oh, there we go. I am. <laughs> My eBay. My eBay, come on. I'm Alfie. Alfie. Three nine three two. Right, and I've got. Do you remember us talking about me um, the other week? I said I had a, a what do you call it, a samurai warrior on my back. And now I asked my missus in Thailand if she, if she had a picture of it, and she did. So I've got uh, I've got that somewhere to show you. Ah, oh, there we go. There it is. Well, I've got me, uh, there's me Hong Kong Fui one, that's what I call my laughter page, Dick Dastardly and Muttley and Danger Mouse and Bugs Bunny. Okay, so let's have a look, and, uh, and here, now you'll have to excuse the crack in me, the crack in me, in me, Crackalino. That's my. I'm like a gorilla. I'll just try and I'll put my crack down there. <laughs> but you can see, see how he's charging with his his thingamajig. With his flag and that that's um one of these. Buddha things that's supposed to protect you in uh, Thailand. I've got that either side of my head. I've got that thing on my head, that's a scarab. And uh, yeah, I've got a few. But anyway, I wanted to show you them. I'm 27 minutes down, it'll be cutting off any second now. Appreciate you watching. Take care, and I'll see you in the next episode of. Diecast Alfie. Bye for now. <coughs> oh,